Welcome to DIY Solar Homestead. So we're getting things ready. We got three storms coming in. I double checked all the wiring to find out which solar array is each set of cords going into the basement. I use a rubber stopper, okay? I drilled holes in it and I run the wires through that. Then I put the stopper in through the window base <laughs> and I caulked it from both sides. So everything's sealed and all the wires going in independently. Solar panels in the backyard are grid tied into the garage. If the neighbor would take this tree down, I'd have them all out here. But I got a heater hooked up. So that's getting ready. The polar vortex coming in. The rainstorm before that. So yeah, tomorrow's rain and rain Monday, freezer rain Tuesday, Wednesday, polar vortex one, polar vortex two, and I'm getting ready. Michigan has been reported. We're almost getting their uh, power shut off because we're drawn, our, our electrical system is not set up for such a draw for a polar vortex of such magnitude with such a weaning magnetosphere and a weaning ionosphere and the dimming of the sun. So Canada is set up and uh, Russia is set up like that. Northern Europe is set up, but we are not. And they almost cut it. They were getting this close to cutting the electrical grids all over Michigan for this last polar vortex. So I'm getting ready. I'll show you the heater. Okay, so you see the heater. I got that set up. That was an eBay product. I put that over there in the corner. The tent stove's working pretty good. I'm no longer getting any smoke from the exhaust. I just make little fires. I think if, if the power went down, oh, I only have a gallon of that so far. If the power went down, I got enough wood in the garage, I think I could prevent from having frozen pipes. I found distilled water for the batteries. I got four batteries right there. I got one there. And I got four inside here. These are grid tied. So... All of those outside, the 13 solar panels are grid tied. And the two big solar batteries, I've never even tapped into those yet. I'm getting ready to pull out the torch and get ready to start making cables. And if you haven't seen the cables, here they are. Four out welding wire. It's the size of my thumb, pretty much. So that'll all be going into the system here pretty soon. I got the outback upstairs. I need to get that wired in over there. That needs to drop to the floor. That's way too heavy for that oak table. So anyway, update. Three storms coming in. Four if you want to call it that. So I got to get ready for the grid to go down. And uh, got to have the system up and running. I need to have it up and running. Working extremely well. So when I do find a real house, for a homestead, then I'll be good to go. <laughs> be prepared, not scared. That's what Diamond always says. All right, thanks for watching. Have a nice sunny day.